In this video, I'm going to introduce you how to access your Microsoft Teams using uh, a web browser. So the first thing you have to do is obviously log into Glow, and the easiest way to do that is in the browser, go to Google Chrome or Internet Explorer, and just search Glow RM Unify. So when you search for that, it's usually the the first page that loads up. So Glow, sign in. Now the account that we are going to log in is a dummy account. So Whereas your pupil login will be ED016, followed by obviously your, your account details. Uh, so I'm just going to log in. And it will take me to this kind of the first kind of splash page. Now, this is St. Ninian's High School splash page, so we've got a number of different tiles that you have our access to. Uh, but for now, we're just going to concentrate on obviously Microsoft Teams. So we'll click the tile and it will load up with the following. Now if this is the first time doing this with your account, it might be a bit slower logging in, just so it gets used to the kind of the settings as such. So as you can see, the first page that is loaded up is My Teams. You know, So this is obviously a dummy account for a pupil and it's been assigned to just this simple class here. Now you might find you have three, four, even eight, nine, you know, depending on what you've been uh, access to. So I'll just kind of give you a brief overview. Now within here you have activity. Now this gives you a kind of a highlight of what's been happening. So a wee kind of social feed. Uh, if I click Teams, it will give me a link to all my teams. So I click back, you'll see the teams and assignments followed by calendar and files. Now again, we're just going to concentrate on the basic uh, team layouts and how to get used to it first. There will be another video which will show you in greater depth of different parts of Teams. So for now, I'm just going to click into Intro to MS Teams. So we've logged in, we've clicked into the class that we want to look at and the first page you see is this kind of splash page. Now this is where it's all happening. This is where you'll find announcements such as this one, welcome to Microsoft Teams. And as you can see, there has been a reply saying thank you. And there has been maybe a link or other kind of emotive uh, uh, kind of liking to it. So again, if you go into Teams, you can reply. So for instance, thank you again. And again, I could even do a little, do you know what? Love that one. So that's how easy it is to kind of interact with a post. I can collapse that if I want, so I don't want to hide and tidy it up a wee bit. And as you can see, we also have a scheduled meeting. Now, maybe as time goes on, you might be invited to join a meeting. And to do that, it's actually quite easy to join. So it should appear in your kind of feed as such and the kind of posts. So when you click this, you'll be given the options. As you can see, there's, it's just loading. So you can see maybe when it's happening. So currently it's active this now. Uh, who is organise it? So it's Mr. McCune that's kind of set this up. And you can you can actually read the how to join a meeting, the set up options. But the easiest way is just click join in the corner here. So when I hit join, you'll see the name of the Meeting is called How to Join a Meeting. And I've got these things here. So video sharing is disabled. You'll not be allowed to uh, show yourself. It's only your microphone. So when I click Join Now, you'll see it's connecting. Now, as this is a dummy uh, meeting, nothing's happening. Okay. Now, as time goes on, you'll find that maybe this will populate with different kind of people in it. Uh, maybe even a shared screen. But for now, we'll just come out of this. And again, you get a call called. I'll just dismiss this. So that is just a quick introduction to, to Teams and how to access it via the the web browser way. Now again, there will be follow-up videos showing you, you know, different parts of Teams, such as the files, the class notebook, the assignments, and other parts that are maybe interested to you. Now to get back to all your Teams, you can just click here and it'll take you back. Now, as time goes on, you might find you've got other tiles and this might go bold, you know, it might be a bit darker, the, the kind of wording. Now that is there just to alert you that there's been an update of some sort. Maybe there's been a, you know, a new post or there's been other kind of things added. 
So hopefully that gives you a, a clearer indication of how to use Teams. Good luck.